Hello everybody, I'm in the Littlewood, also known as Martin. Welcome back to the channel and welcome back to South Park, the Fracture But Hole. Let's get into this fight, shall we? We are now the final girl class. The final girl in every horror movie, that is. Let's see what happens. Get up, Boofy. Hell no. I ain't fighting no final girl with that lucky <laughs> surviving ass. That's my kryptonite, baby. I'm out oh, here. she's going to run away. Thank God. Right, time to make clean up then. Let's do it. Okay, butthole. Why don't you see how your final girl powers work on these monsters? All right. Let's see what abilities we got then. Right, so from there, we got the buzzsaw. Pretty good. Goes forwards and then... Oh, actually, it's got like a really huge, I guess, like diamond shape on its grid. Look at that beneath its ability. Any A presses here or not? Nope, they just drop down and do their business. Saw bleed sets a trap that damages enemies who pass through it. Ooh, or at the start of their turn. Nice. All this blood is making Mintberry Crunch queasy. <laughs> Not surprised. Is a fair bit. Got a bleeder. The final girl is nice and all, but all this blood. All right, butthole. Let's see what you got. All right, let's have a look. Um, let me see what we got here. We got target foe for exploding. For ex wait, wait, for exploding. Hold on a minute. Let me go ahead and use this. Who are we going to do it on? Bottom guy or this guy? Let's go for that one. Press A to use your power. Oh, interesting. And then detonate with B. Okay, sure. Stand here. And then you choose your victim's knockback direction. Cool. Oh, so I can bring them towards me or send them back. Interesting. Oh, wait, wait. I can push you downwards and then through the bus saws. Oh, sick. Wasn't that great, that little hit, but still. Right, that all makes sense now. So we had double bleeding as well as damage. That's sick. That's so good. And is he dead? Yeah, he's trying to get out of the way of it. <laughs> he's struggling. There he goes. My friend. Right, ultimate move then. Let's see what we got. This is called the Final Vengeance. Personally execute low health foes. Let's have it. I wonder how low they need to be. Oh, look at that machine. Oh, what? Slay foes one by one. Oh my god, it reminds me of Stick Death. Does anybody remember that website? That was a big thing when I was a kid. Look at that. Was that actually 20,000 damage? Good god. Whoa. Holy crap, that's dangerous. Get out of here, kids! You don't belong oh, mate, you don't want to mess with just me. Now you're going to have my whole squad <laughs> to deal with as well. With these monsters. Let's get them. <laughs> Go on, Mintberry Crunch. Right, time to get them. Let's press it. So this should what? It should cleanse and mint allies. So that should be everybody all set. Sweet. I don't know what that grid space is though. Do I need to actually select just one ally? Tell you what, let me do it on just... Let's do it just there. I would have thought everybody in that radius gets covered. Oh, that only selects one of you. Right, I'm with you. Sorry, I thought that ability did it for everybody. All right, let's see what we got then. Uh, so we can have do that, or we get a big kick in. Right in the chops. Gotcha. <laughs> God. Jeez. All right, let's go. But that's what you got for me, friend. Um, you can go upstairs, right? Yeah, should we focus on the big guy first? I reckon so. Maybe if we confuse the big boy. Because if he's going to be the strongest one, we'd rather not have him up against us. There you go. Right, let's have a look then. So, scissors. Or we can put down our buzz saws. Let's do that. So he's going to get them at the start of their turn. And then if the other guy happens to pass through as well. Nice. Good job. Right, Mint Mary Crunch. Let's have a look, dude. Cleansing Mint Allies take flight. Okay. That's how we do that. So we've all been minted, but none of those guys have been um, buried yet. But they will be if we keep on doing damage. They'll be buried six feet under. Way. Man, they are just bleeding everywhere. <laughs> Look at him go. Oh, and he's not going to kill his mate. Awesome. Look, I'm sorry, but there's no monsters allowed in this camp. Man, he got knocked back as well into that slot. Right, what are we going to do here? Uh, What you got for me, speedster? I say speedster. Wait, can I really move that far? Wow, I didn't realize I had, like, such a huge cone of movement. Uh, let's see. Yeah, let's go for the big boy. Don't think that will knock him out. This is confusion just yet. It's got, like, no health, though. All right, but 
Do your business. Hopefully we get some bonus damage. Oh, no, he did survive by the skin of his teeth. Dude, come on. Right, i tell you what then. Let's go ahead and throw in this bad boy. Uh, I might need to move forwards by one. Or if I just do it here, this should be fine. And that should knock him downwards. And then if I move back to here, there we go. And then I can choose you to go downwards and you'll bump into your friend. Hopefully that will take out both of you. Let's see what happens. That's you done. And there they go. Nice. We win! Jack a suit, Jack a head, and the Scarum's makeup kit. So we can look extra spooky. Where did you hide the missing counselor? Yeah. With the he's not a real monster, it's just a mask. First the counselors go missing, now people wearing masks are trying to scare us away from camp. What the heck is going on? Hey, this is like that one episode of Scooby-Doo. Butthole, your fighting style reminds me of the girl that doesn't die at the end of horror movies. Good work, <laughs> but I'm afraid this is only the beginning. Dr. Timothy, did you find anything? This is more serious than we thought, Jimmy. Meet me in the mess hall. There's something you all need to see. What? All right, thank God. Congratulations, butthole. You earned the Super Sleuth Summer Camp Merit Badge. Oh, nice. Congratulations to us. Man, we're going to have a full sash by the end of this summer. I can't, I can't, I can't press on A. What? Hello? Oh, there you go. <laughs> you can earn merit badges for doing all sorts of helpful things around camp. It's fun and productive at the same time. Pretty cool, right? Right. So we've got like mini objectives. Now go out there and collect them all. We need to have 800 power in order to do them though. Like what rank are we right now? I don't even really remember. Uh, oh, we are actually 800. Okay, perfect. So with all the artifacts, we are good to go. Um, is there any new artifacts I can put on? I hadn't really thought about that. Let's have a look. Um, no, everything's still 100s and stuff. Looks like we're in a pretty good spot. Let's continue onwards then. I'm glad that there's something in the mess hall, by the way, because obviously I was struggling that before. God, Round supper time, here. folks here hear an old lady's voice near the campfire whistling. And I didn't get to read the rest of that. Oh, okay, that's changed since. Uh, okay. How do I get up to you, friend? Oh, wait, am I stuck in the benches? There we go. You idiot. We've right. got to find those missing counselors, but hope. Let's go in. What's Dr. Timothy got? I found one of the counselors. I'm afraid oh. he's dead. Are you sure he's dead? Maybe he's just sleeping. No, he's super dead. I poked him with a stick. Come on, this is totally fake. Someone's just trying to scare us. First fake monsters, and now a fake body. If this was a real body, then this Don't would be real blood. No, I knew he would do that instantly. Huh? And this would be real blood. Hmm, this is definitely real blood. Real blood? Ugh. You mean this is really real? Huh? We're all gonna die. We need to find the other counselors before they suffer the same fate. I'm sensing vibrations of psychic trauma in some areas of the camp. I'll send the locations to your phones. Right, if you say so, Professor Timmy. Good God. Oh, God, he's here. Hey, up, mate. Sorry, What's going on? Spooky around here. <laughs> Why have you made your way up to the camp? I thought you said we shouldn't go down that road. And now you've come down this road, and now I'm very confused. You know what I mean? I don't know why I'm talking like this for the rest of the episode. I should probably stop. Let's have a look and see if we go into the showers. Yeah, we couldn't go in here last time, could we? Oh! Okay. Look, but Naked old man. Camp is saved. <laughs> okay, super friends, set a perimeter. Cover the entrance. We're not going to let anything happen to this. Look, there's those kids. Get them. I mean, <laughs> is this adult going to help us or what? Oh, no, nope, he's just going to do his thing in the background. Awesome. Let me help you take off those limbs. Oh, jeez, he's gearing up for something. Some oh, God, you're all what gearing up for something. You? That idiot kidding me. In the shower is next. Right, we need to move everybody in by one and then just see what we can do. Uh, what do we got? Let's go for... I guess let's go for you. Actually, I don't really know. I don't really want them to move in any kind of direction, let's be honest. We kind of want them to stay where they are. Yeah, let's put these down. This will mess with them. And I've basically moved my character over to the left so the other three should have enough movement to get into the clean line. There you go. Right, Mint Merry Crunch, you do your thing. Um, not really anything to be done here. I'll mint upon my friends, why not? And we'll get some berries in soon enough. Right, there we go. Uh, that should be fine as it is. In fact, if I stand here, uh, what's cancel? RB. Yeah, if I stand here, I could probably do some damage to these guys. And then we can move Butters up by one, and we should be safe for the round. Hey, they can't sing that. That's Butters' song. Right, let's have a look. Um, confusion? Yeah, you know what? I'm going to confuse this guy since he's got the most health. 
There we are. Right, so that should be us all set now. So they're going to do their moves and get hemorrhaged at the start. Cool, no problem. Mmm, he's trying to move down. So it's just a case of us moving up and down every so often. What? Oh, no. I thought he was giving up for his move then. I was like, what? It's not fair. Good job. I got a hankering for child. That's what fine. Doesn't kill me makes me really fucking angry. <laughs> there we go. Your abilities are all finished up. Right, so once again, need to move everybody up to the top and just continue on with what we were doing. Um, I'll tell you what we could do. Can I reach this ability from here? Oh, no, maybe not. That's fine. Let's just go ahead and... Should we go like that? How far away can I stand? So I can attack you from this range, or I can attack you and do more bleeding. Let's just do that. Although you haven't lined up for an ability just yet, which I'm a little bit worried about. I probably should have gone up by one. Oopsie. Although it only seems to be the middle guy who's gearing up for a move like that now. Land anywhere and bury foes. Oh, yes. Land. Ah, oh, see, if you land there, you only get those ones. I'll tell you what, that guy's really low, the one at the top. So let's just bury the bottom two. There we are. Oh, it's throwing me in the corner. I didn't realize. Oopsie. Uh, let's skip that turn. And we'll have to wait three turns for that one to come back up. What? I thought you were confused. All right, apparently not. Right, Jimmy, out of the way, mate. Let's get your ability kicking off. Uh, can you hit anyone with that? Yeah, you can hit him. Go for it. I am worried about Mintberry Crunch being in that corner, though. I guess we'll just have to see what happens. What do we got? Yeah, finish off this guy. Nice. See you later, mate. One down, four to go. He should probably die in a moment. Probably at the end of his turn. Or if he tries moving from there. Yeah, there he goes. Oh, no, he did die. Wow, really? No, yeah, there he goes. <laughs> there you go. One hit. Second hit at the top. Nice. And then we just move out of your way. So let's focus on these guys in the bottom right corner now then, seeing as the guy in the top left is not going to do anything, you know, outside of where he currently is. Uh, let's see. Can I stand here with that? Yeah, I can. Cool. Let's go like that. And then if I stand out of the way a little bit, and I'm going to get you to go downward, it's going to hit the two of you. That humming in the shower is getting really annoying as well. It's obviously turned down for you guys, but <laughs> it's starting to get on my nerves a little bit. Right, let's have a look. What can we do here? Uh, big attack on you two? Sure, why not? Midberry Splash! I can't remember what the word he says is. He's got some like special word, hasn't he? Uh-oh! Uh, he really doesn't. Oh, God. Oh, yeah, I'm protected. Of course I am. Nice. Right, let's see. What can we do here? Um, that's only going to do damage to the one guy in the row, and that's it. Let's just focus on regular moves for now, then. We'll wait for an enemy, or an ally, sorry, that's got a group move. Gotcha. Nice. Right, Fest Chaos, I reckon you probably have something of use here. Yeah, you know what? Let's have it. Anybody that's left is going to get shocked, and I think maybe confused as well, so this will be good. Three for the price of one. Nice. Right, three to go. You're going to do your move. All right. Who wants to get eaten tonight? Oh, dear. Are you gearing up for another one? Okay, cool. I don't mind that too much. If we move upwards as well, the buzzsaw should... Oh, actually, maybe the buzzsaws aren't there anymore. I'll lay them back out again. Why not? So, move that to there. So, he'll die at the start of his turn, so we don't have to worry about him anymore. And then we can start dealing with the other guys. I maybe should have focused my attacks over that way instead, but whatever. Oh, he's struggling. He can't get a line of sight on anyone. That's fine. I wonder if they hurt each other if they go to do that ability. You know what I mean? That'd be interesting if they did. Uh, what do we got? Let's see. Cleanse and mint allies. Bury foes. I uh, don't really know what I want to do here. If I go back to here. I'll go here and I'll mint everybody. So he's going to vanish for a little while. There we are. Let's see what we can do here. Um, so that one. Yeah, let's go for it. Nice. Gotcha. Right, Professor Chaos, what you got, mate? 
Um, we could try and confuse you. I just don't know how much that would work. If I were to kill you, that would still have me in the line of sight of those three. So that's not going to work. Yeah, no, I'll tell you what then. Let's just do this then. Um, or actually, can I bring in an ally? Nah, not really feeling the ally. Let's confuse the guy at the back. Because if the other two guys are going to be locked on the spot for a while, we might as well have our third guy confused because then they're all relatively harmless. Although it is kind of like Pokemon, it seems, where <laughs> they're not always confused. Oh, they do hit each other. Nice. Oh, he's about to kill him back then. Oh, he's going to die to the buzzsaw like he just did. Oh, he didn't die to it, really? No, yeah, he's gone. Right, let's see what we can do then. Uh, let's go ahead and throw out one of these bad boys. Oh, that's not going to reach far enough. Like that. And I need the knockback to go into the other dude, so go again. Uh, let's go to the right. Enemy down. He's probably going to die any second now. Oh, let's not lose anybody. Why not? Let's get through with a clean sheet. Might as well. And now he's dead to shock. Awesome. <laughs> Best skip ever. There we go. Right, let's find out what this camp counselor's doing. Does he have any information or is he completely yes, unaware as to what's happening? Now we can have camp. Hey, mister. What? Who's in here? Ah. Oh, God, I just flashed my dick to a bunch of little kids. Please tell my wife I love her. Oh, my God. Oh, no. This is so horrible. Yeah, now we're never going to have camp. Well, let's keep looking. We only need one living counselor for the camp to stay open. <laughs> right. Okay, uh, let's get his brains off the ceiling, shall we? There's probably going to be something worthwhile in those. Oh, it's just regular biohazard. Jesus Christ, dude. I, ge I genuinely didn't expect him to do that. That just seemed a bit much, you know what I mean? So we can enter the basement there. We'll go down in a second. Let me have a quick look over here and see what's on the mirror. Is that something I can knock off? Yeah. A little bit more biohazard. In the cupboard, we've got some revenge away. That's about your lot. Right. Let's see. Good job cleaning that mess, but whole slippery floors are no fun for anyone. Thanks, Jimmy. Right, before we do that, I want to quickly grab whatever's inside of this chest here. There we go. Well, in fact, do I need to do any of that? Oh, maybe I do, actually, yeah. What happens if I break that? Oh, what's that? Whoa, wait, wait, what's that? Dude, I have no idea what that is. Oh. Wait, what? Now I'm suddenly caved in. You know, in the old days, miners formed a powerful bond with their canaries. It weren't just a carbon monoxide or something or other. So that's only going to stop there. Okay, so let's let's do a quick rewind. There you go. You're fixed. So you're not going to go all the way across, are you? Because you'll just break there. What happens if I break it now, though? There we go. No, I think that's just kind of busted, isn't it? It's kind of stuck. Interesting. That is weird, isn't it? I don't really know what it's hinting at me to do there. Other than take a picture. It had a picture icon on it, like a camera one. But that was about it. Can I go? Oh, I can go across that. Oh, okay. I assume that's what it was, but... Just didn't seem to want to let me go. Oh, wait. Let me uh, break this bad boy. There you go. Probably pull this oil out. Oh, you can just jump over it. Hibbity hop. There you go. Bush hat. Grab the canary down. Hello, friend. Oh, can I not reach you? Oh, maybe I need to climb up to it. Let's see. Oh, I tell you what, if I stand on this side and then rewind the damage that I've done to that box, that should give me a way up there. Yeah, cool. There you go. A little staircase. Right, now is there a way of getting this down? Because if I hit that, and I'm probably going to have to pause time, right? Because I'm assuming that I can't climb up there because the steam will get me. Oh, no, maybe not. Sweet. Haunted birdcage. Oh, that was just like one of the other random quests that we had. Oh, cool. I like that you can complete them without having to, like, initiate the quest in the first place. You know what I mean? Oh, let me get off of there real quick. Break that. Let me through. Right, what's left over here, then? Can I hit that to turn the valve? No, I can't. What about if I hit this? What do you do? All oh, right, so you let me go upstairs. Cool. That means I can rewind and skip past all that. Hmm. So much exploration to be had. What have we got? First aid kit. Nah, not feeling it. Oh, how would I move you then? 
Is there anything I can zap up there? No, nothing there. Hmm. Oh! <laughs> oh no! As if I died. Are you kidding me? I thought that would be fine to walk across. I guess maybe just because I was on it when it fell. That was the problem that we had there. Fair enough. Although it did look like I could stand in there to like try and grab that chest, but sort of not letting me now. Oh, it's locked at the moment. Oh, jeez. Okay, hold on. Let's bust that pipe open. See if that helps at all. Oh, that gets the engine going. Interesting. And then, do I need to hit that? Or is that just the... Oh, oh, interesting. Cool. Now, I don't know if that actually opens the door or not. Let me pause that real quick. Maybe now it'll open because it's got some power going to it. Yeah, cool. And inside of there is a Lumber Kid outfit. Sweet. I think that might be it for inside of here. Let's see, let's hold down LT. No, nothing else over here. So there is just that one last chest of, uh, of booty to be had. But I'm not entirely sure how I'm meant to go about getting it. It almost looks like I can grab that. Oh, I can grab that. I thought I could. Right, so I'm going to have to pause some time, climb up it, push the box, and then I can climb up to the non-electrified bit. Sweet. Up you go. Go, 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 go. Push the box out the way. Nice. Rewind. Cool. Yeah, the little, like, yellow, like, handle things is such a good little mechanic, isn't it? They've done a good job with that. Uh, oh, wait, maybe it was meant to be the other way. Oh, yeah, maybe it was. Damn it. Hold on a minute. Well, in fact, I think I can just do it from here, right? So I push you right the way to the end, and then do pause. I think I can just pull it all the way to the right, and then I'll be fine. Or at least further than myself. Oh, no, my own body blocks it. Oh, dude. Weak. Right, hopefully this is quick enough. Oh, go, 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 go. Pull it right the way along. Yeah, that's what I want. Now nah, it's completely out of the way. So fingers crossed, they should be able to use this ladder now. Not the, not the one that I'm pulling, but the other one, the big metal one, to get out of here. I'd like to think. I've climbed on worse ladders before. Yes, there you go, dude. So where does this bring us out at? Oh! Oh, it brings us back out at the start. Oh, <laughs> interesting. So I wonder if the guys over here doesn't want us to go down that road. Let's find out. Anybody at the gasoline? There he is. Hunt Hope, there's one more area to investigate. The location is on your phone. Get there as soon as you can. All right, let me have a quick look. Uh, Lake Tardy Kaka. Where is it you want me to go? Oh, is it over here at the burial ground? Oh, geez, that sounds intense. That is probably going to be a bunch of fights. So, I'm going to leave it there for today, everybody. Thank you so much for I watching. In the next you episode... Gone down that road. <laughs> You're always getting down the road before me, so shut up. Uh, but anyway, yeah, thanks for watching, everybody. In the next episode, we are going to go to the burial ground and see what is cracking. And I'll see what you tomorrow. Bye-bye.